Goodbye! What's up, everybody? What's up? This is your boy, B. Adams. We are here live at Adams Barbershop, 5138 West Madison, Chicago, Illinois, 606. I didn't think this video would come so soon. If you didn't know, I've already said this multiple times. You're a barber. Yes, I am a sneakerhead. And I have another purchase. Not only that, but today we also bid farewell to a pair of kicks out of the barber shoe rotation. Yes, just as you witnessed from the intro of this video, the Air Max 270s has officially danced their last dance. Sometimes you just gotta know when to fold them and that cushion wasn't holding me up anymore for comfort during my long days of work. So I had to turn that hand in and just back away from the table. And no, that swift kick to the bubble that you witnessed in the beginning of the video is not the fate that awaits these 270s. I will actually be giving these away to someone less fortunate that needs them. No point of throwing away a good pair of shoes when someone out here that does not have any shoes at all on their feet can definitely use them. Now, let's get to the good stuff. New in the barber shoe rotation. Yes, I just picked these up the other day. The LeBron. Wait a minute, what is this? I don't even know. The Nike Inc. Basketball 2020 Witness V5. The Air Zoom Witness V5. I picked these joints up. I picked these joints up at Burlington Coat Factory. Yeah, 40 bucks. 40 bucks. You can't beat it. Definitely has a soul that can handle my long days, tough days here at the barber shop, standing on my feet hours on end, definitely look like it's durable enough to hold me all day. I don't know if he's ever played in these, but uh, if they can hold up LeBron game after game, I'm pretty sure they can take me standing up here at the barber shop. 40 bucks, you can't beat it. Comfort, breathability, durability to handle your barber shop days and nights standing up all day chasing that money getting those clients in and out to where they need to go i think these can handle the job and for 40 bucks for 40 bucks you got a fresh pair of nikes you got a little air bubble situation in there you can't beat it we are not gonna pay a lot of money but we are going to have comfortability and style while standing behind this barber chair. Now, on to a pair that has made their way into the barber shoe rotation. I'm a little sad about this one, but they gotta go. Yes, just as you saw these giving that pair of 270s the swift kick to the bubble in the intro to the video, the gold Air Max 97s has officially made their way to the chopping block. I really hated to do it because these are definitely one of my favorite Air Maxes of all time. These and the silver bullets definitely, definitely on my top Air Max of all time list, but I think I have worn them past the point of freshness anymore. So they have to make their way to the barber shoe rotation. Now, as distraught as I am about transferring these over, I'm really not that mad because lately I've been seeing these re-release pretty frequently. And if I'm not mistaken, these are actually in stock. So I can go pick up another pair with no problem. I may do that in the future. Matter of fact, I'm almost certain sometime in the future I will be getting a fresh pair of these. But these particular pair, you will be seeing behind the barber chair from now on. I think at this point I am done, at least for a while, purchasing new shoes to wear behind the barber chair. 
I think in the future, the near future, it may be more shoes transitioning over from my personal collection to the barber shoe rotation. I think at this point we've got about four, yeah, I got four, four pair of kicks and a barber shoe rotation. That's more than enough for me because there is really no rotation with me when I wear my, my shoes to work. I really try to see how bad I can beat up one pair of kicks standing behind the barber chair. You know what? I think that may be the next extension of the barber sneakerhead preference. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick one of these new pair of shoes that I have in the barber rotation and do sort of like a time lapse of just how long it takes to beat one of these pair of kicks in the dirt from standing behind the barber chair. Okay, I've officially added a new pair. I've kicked a pair to the curb and I transitioned the pair over from the personal shoe collection. So I think we can call this an episode. I'm your boy B. Adams reporting live here at Adams Barbershop, 5138 West Madison, Chicago, Illinois, 60644. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and if you need to see us on other platforms, don't forget to like and follow the Adams Barbershop Facebook page. You can catch me b.adams5138 on Instagram. You can always Google us because we're Googleable. Y'all already know it's time for me to get up out of here. I got some hair to cut, some errands to run, some more footage to record. So I'll holla at y'all. <laughs>